Hello today's video we have the following content. Zhang Han, a gentleman knight in the entertainment industry, an elegant walker of dreams and reality. In the dazzling galaxy of China's entertainment industry, Zhang Han has created unforgettable characters one after another with his unique temperament and unremitting efforts, and has become a backbone that cannot be ignored in contemporary film and television dramas. Born on October 6, 1984 in Chichihar City, Heilongjiang Province, he embarked on the road to pursue his dream of light and shadow after graduating from the Central Academy of Drama. From a fledgling young boy to a mature and capable actor today, Zhang Han's growth trajectory is a vivid portrayal of dreams, persistence and transformation. The first time he entered the public eye was in the 2009 youth idol drama Let's Watch the Meteor Shower. Nguyen Yanhe, played by Zhang Han, quickly captured the hearts of thousands of girls with his handsome appearance and affectionate eyes. This drama not only made him famous overnight, but also established his status in the field of idol dramas. However, Zhang Han is not satisfied with this. He knows that as an actor, continuous challenges and transformation are the long-term solution. In the following years, Zhang Han actively tried various types of roles, from Kim Lang and accidentally falling in love with you to Feng Tang and Shan Shen is here. He gradually broadened his acting options improved it with practical action zone versatility. Especially with his performance in Wolf Warrior 2, Zhang Han completely subverted the previous idol image. His role as Suo Yifen allowed people to see more possibilities and depth of him as an actor. This transformation not only won the recognition of the audience, but also won him multiple acting award nominations, achieving a gorgeous transformation from a popular niche to a powerful actor. Zhang Han's charm is not only reflected in front of the camera. In life, he shows himself to be humble, polite, and gentle and is affectionately called the pond master by his fans. He has unique insights into fashion. Every time he makes a public appearance, he can show the gentlemanly demeanor of a modern man with a simple yet stylish dressing style. At the same time, Zhang Han is enthusiastic about public welfare and has participated in many charity activities. He uses his influence to convey positive energy and demonstrates the social responsibility of a public figure. In terms of career, Zhang Han is constantly seeking innovation and breakthroughs. In 2017, he established a personal studio and began to try out his role as a producer, personally participating in the planning and production of projects, striving to have more autonomy and creativity in film and television creation. The success of works such as If Paris Is Not Happy is the best proof of his vision and hard work. In addition, Zhang Han also actively participates in cross-border cooperation and is involved in many fields such as music and fashion, fully demonstrating his artistic talent and business acumen. Zhang Han's story is a journey about growth, self-transcendence and dream realization. In this process, he always insisted on himself, had the courage to explore the unknown, told different stories with each work, and also wrote his own life chapter. In the days to come. I believe that Zhang Han will continue to use his extraordinary courage and wisdom to sail the sailing ship of dreams, sail in a broader ocean of performing arts, and bring more surprises and touches to the audience. Next news. Liu Tao talked about 79-year-old Zheng Pipei on the show and lamented, she is not in good health now and needs help. Zhang Han once said, life is endless encounters and partings. Ten years go by in a blink of an eye. After finishing speaking, tears overflowed from the corners of Zhang Han's eyes. What he shed was not just tears, but the lost years. Ten years ago, Zhang Han was full of youth, but now he has reached his forties and has turned into a middle-aged appearance. The handsomeness he once had is no longer replaced by the traces of time. The middle-aged Zhang Han has a mediocre career, has never found his favorite partner, and has not yet entered in a marriage. Time flies and youth is gone. Zhang Han's tears are a reflection of the irreversible time. Zhang Han was sentimental because Liu Ta's words touched him. Liu Tao showed a tour guide bag from 10 years ago, which also contained items such as euros and mobile phones left over from the Hua Xiao program at that time. Liu Tao was the last tour guide of that season and was responsible for keeping these items. Over the years, Liu Tao has kept this tour guide bag on his bedside table, untouched. When Liu Tao took out these items, the memories belonging to them unfolded like a movie. She also showed off signed photos of everyone at the time. Look at Liu Tao 10 years ago. She was young and full of energy. She said that what she liked most was herself at that time. Ten years ago, Zhen Pipei was in good spirits. Although she was 69 years old and had gray hair, she was still full of positive energy. 
In comparison, other members of the later Flower Young Master failed to show Zheng Pipei's magnanimity and magnanimity. This is why everyone always remembers Zheng Pipei. Some people can always bring you the warmth of spring. Zheng Pipei is such an elder. In the show, despite her advanced age, she still drags her luggage by herself and walks with everyone, never complaining about being tired. Liu Tao recalled the intimate time with Zheng Pipei on the show. Zhen Pipei gave her great emotional support and became her strong backing. Zhen Pipei once gave Liu Tao a piece of calligraphy, how can it not be as perfect as everyone wants, but I hope it will be worthy of my heart. Over the years, whenever Liu Tao faced difficulties, she would always think of this sentence to motivate herself. Zhen Pipei became Liu Tao's role model. Every year after the show ended, Zhen Pipei would write a post to express her longing for Liu Tao. Now Zhang Pipei is 79 years old and lives abroad with her daughter. Liu Tao sighed and said, Zhang Pipei's health is now worse than before and she needs help even to walk. Listening to Liu Tao say these words, I lamented the passage of time. Unexpectedly, Zhang Pipei, who was once strong, has reached an age where she needs support. Fortunately, her daughter Atomic Megumi is by her side. Chen Pipei retired from the film industry in the 1970s and later married Chinese-American businessman Yuan Wentong, with whom she has four children. Zheng Pepe has been pregnant eight times, suffered four miscarriages, and has three daughters of similar ages. Although she eventually gave birth to a son, her marriage came to an end. After that, she worked to make money while raising her children, and she had the deepest relationship with her youngest daughter. Due to wearing a mask due to the epidemic, Zhen Pipei was unable to be with her daughter Atomic Wei when she gave birth. A year later, after seeing her mother's living conditions abroad, her daughter decided to move abroad to live with her mother. As Liu Tao said, Zhen Pipei's body is indeed no longer convenient and she needs to travel in a wheelchair most of the time. Her daughter was cared for by workers. Chen Pipei's inconvenience in her legs and feet may be one of the reasons why she filmed fighting scenes when she was young. Although she has been off the screen for many years, Zhen Pipei's positive energy and magnanimity are still mentioned by people. Life is a long road, but there are always some people who can heal us with their kindness and warmth. Thank you for watching the video, please leave your opinion in the comments section. Don't forget to press the channel subscription button. If this is the first time you watch a video on the channel, 